This is a CSS tutorial in 30 seconds or so, and it's brought to you by tutvid.com. So we know that when we design a website on our computer, we have to upload it to a server which is connected to the web and allows everyone to go to our domain name and view the contents of our server. Well, how do we make a website in our HTML and make it look good? Well, the answer, let me get rid of all these icons and stuff, the answer is something called uh, CSS. So we have a web page, an actual page on our website that contains a bunch of code, maybe contains images, video, sound files, other crazy inventions that we have, images, and all kinds of other colors and styles and just random assorted stuff. Well, all of this is organized into these nice neat blocks, not by HTML, it's by something called CSS. So all of this stuff goes into our page and we have the CSS file that is linked to our HTML page. Now the advantage of using CSS as an external file is the CSS would, will tell the HTML file things like, hey, your background color is bright red and every image is going to have a light gray border around it and um, every, every link is going to be colored green. Now this is advantageous when you have 50 pages in your website and you decide, you know what, I don't want my background color to be red anymore. More. I want it to be, you know, kind of like a more modest gray. Well, instead of going to every single one of your 50 HTML pages and editing the background color, you simply go to the CSS file that's linked to all those HTML pages and you say, hey, background color of my HTML file, change it from the red to the gray. And boom, it automatically changes over every single page on your website that's connected to that CSS file. So CSS, cascading style sheets, they are incredibly important and vital to a great web design. You need to learn how to use CSS, but don't fear. It's really easy to learn how to do it. It totally makes sense. And it's a language that actually works. And you can see here, so important to having a great HTML website and making it very easy to edit in the future. So that's CSS and that's how CSS works and that's why CSS is important. And that's it. Get it? Got it? Good. Nathaniel Dodson, tutvid.com. I'll catch you in the next one.